No contouring can disguise that though, can it? No. Guys, check out my makeup. I just did this crazy makeup. Look at my look at my shadow. My progress so far. I need to add like some text and like some fun stuff. And I need to scan it back in and upload it to Instagram. Yeah! Taking Hannah to the park. Yeah, Nothing yeah, else to do, right? Yeah, With my dad. What? Yeah, Yusuf has gone also to help Sid and Hassan. By the way, whilst I'm in Cardiff, like Sid right now, it's Sid's birthday today, guys, and he's moving all our stuff from Birmingham to London. So, rubbish birthday for him, but to be fair, I had a pretty awful one too, so. So, fair square. <laughs> It's raining after a few days of pure sun. Yeah, I'm vlogging, Bob. Uh, anyway, <laughs> wasn't talking to you, talking to the camera. Sid should be, might be coming back to Cardiff today, inshallah. And so we're gonna go to Boots and that, see if we can get him just some some kind of present. To make him happy. I don't know. Not a good present, maybe a little aftershave and a card from Boobin. So we'll see what we find, but probably won't find anything. I was supposed to go on a big walk today with Hannah and everything, but then it started raining, so. Look at this old jacket I've had for ages. It's vintage, it's not very nice, but don't worry about it. Guys, I'm in Morrison's with my dad, right? Because it's right next it's right next to our house, yeah. But, oh my god. I feel like Tesco and Asda, and even Sainsbury's, you don't get stairs like you do in Morrison. Crazy. And this is all since we left the EU. People think that I should go back to my country. Choji's been missing since Monday night. And it's been two nights now and we're actually really worried because, well, because he's never done that before. And plus he's in Cardiff, which isn't really his home. It's more like his second home, so. Me and Sid, uh, just came back from walking around and looking for him in the pouring rain. We made these flyers as well. Hopefully he is back by the time this video goes up. We're on the way to London guys and basically we're gonna get into the flat. It's gonna be all our shit everywhere. Anyway, I'm editing. We've made it to London in the flat and this is the current situation. Right here. Sid has already done up the sofa before I came so that's good. Behind us is pretty much everything we own. That's the kitchen area. It's a very small flat. I didn't really tell you much about it but it's quite a small flat. Obviously because London's so expensive she just had a nice big boo boo. Basically that's it. We live in London. Although we've got a lot of organising to do. It's just going to be hectic for the next two weeks probably while we sort everything out. So, yeah, I think I'm not going to vlog any more of today. I think today is just going to be resting and seeing where the hell to start. Guys, yesterday we didn't manage to do anything. We just put Hannah to sleep and then watched Game of Thrones and ate our shelves up here. And we don't like it. They look gross. They look gross in this flat. They're too yeah, big. Anyway, really they don't fit anywhere else and they're yellow. They don't we match. We use it for now until we can figure out um, what's Something the else. Option. Currently unpacking all my clothes and I don't know if everything's going to fit. But I do still have space up there so hopefully it will have space down there. So... I've got to go to a meeting so I've had to leave the house. Obviously we haven't finished anything. Yusuf's come over to help. Come on. We go in Ikea, of course. When do we not ever go to Ikea? Whether we're moving or not, me and Sid. But anyway, we go to Ikea because we need to get some bits and... No, you can't. We're going to Ikea because we need to get some bits and bobs for the flat ofs, so... Just press the button. <laughs> Beep. Okay. This is the next day, so this isn't yesterday, although I'm wearing the same thing. Okay, I'm just vlogging because today was the day that I was unpacking all of my scarves, okay? So I was taking them all out, and I was rolling them up, like this. This is how I'm going to be storing them, just underneath my dressing table, in these boxes, you know. Things like that. So, so far, as you can see, I've just got that one box filled up, and I've got a little bit of this one filled up. I, like, finished unpacking them, and I was like, oh, wow, I'm done with the scarves. Then I was like, hold on a minute. I've only got one box of scarves, where the bloody hell are the rest of my scarves, right? Because normally, I mean, in Birmingham I had a whole chest of drawers which was 
three huge drawers full of my scarves. Um, and basically it turns out that Sid chucked them all out by accident. He thought it was a big bag of things I was giving away to charity or things I was just chucking out. And it's literally about two to three hundred scarves, including my big winter ones and like neck scarves, silk patterned ones, things like that. So I'm kind of dealing with that right now. I'm I, I'm going through a little bit of a loss. I like I I haven't even got my head fully around that just yet. That I only have that many scarves in that box right here. All of my big winter neck ones, they're all gone. All of my Dina Tokia ones, they're all gone. All of my vintage square ones, they're all gone. All of my silk, the, everything got. All of my H and M ribbed ones, they're all gone. Everything's gone. I don't have any scarves left. And it's because Sid... Okay, I'm not blaming Sid because obviously he was half asleep and stuff. But oh my god, all my scarves, like, all my scarves gone. Guys, I'm in the process of making another Instagram picture. This one's gonna be an outfit of the day, okay? Because I haven't got time to do real ones right now, okay? Happy Eid from me, Sid and Hannah. Congratulations. You have fasted this whole month. And now it is over. What are you gonna do with your lives? Tell me. Hannah's got two bunches in for Eid. Yeah. I'm not wearing anything special, guys. Don't get excited. So many of you tweeted me like, oh, can't wait, to, can't wait to see what you and Hannah are wearing. Well, I'm just wearing my regular clothes. Hannah's got a nice new outfit on. It's like a nice t-shirt. I'll show it to you guys in a bit. This shirt makes me look like I'm Popeye. Anyway, we went home, freshened up. Hannah was supposed to have a nap, but she didn't. So, whatever. And now we're going to eat some dinner with my sister, my brother, Sid's mates. Some of me and my sister's mates. Basically, because they eat and we all know each other here, so we're all gonna have a meal. And then tomorrow morning, we're gonna go to Wales. That's Hannah's little booty. Do you like your little boots? They're from Mother Care. Yes. Hello. I'm best, Suzanne. I've got a jogging. Okay. 